Hi guys, welcome back. This is Tarun again back with another fitness video for you. Now, you know, this is the standard question. I mean, I mean, almost all the Indian teenagers or almost everybody across the globe has it. That why is it that, you know, people talk about bulking in winters and cutting in summers? You know, is there a science behind it or it's just one of those things that, you know, one of those things that, you know, uh, another myth that came out of nowhere. So in this video, guys, I'll be sharing my experience with if there's any science behind this bulking cutting crap uh, or if there's none i would tell you how you can go about dealing with this stuff so when is the right time for you to bulk when is the right time for you to cut now let's understand why do people talk about uh, uh, bulking in in winters only why not in summers so there is no science behind it guys it's just that you know when it's winters Obviously, you know, uh, bulking is such some people tend to bulk dirty, which means they eat pretty much everything that comes their way. They gain a lot of fat, they gain a lot of water weight, which uh, n is not technically the right way to bulk. But, you know, people have been doing that following what Lee Priest used to do. You know, if, you, if you've seen Lee Priest and if you go to Google Lee Priest, you know, he used to eat pretty much everything, you know, in his uh, off season. And, you know, there was a remarkable difference what he looked like in his off season and his, and his, and his peak time and his competition time so that kind of got misled and people started doing weird things in their off season they started eating everything they thought that you know hey if Libris could do it even I can do it but guys it doesn't work like that that's what I always tell you you know even if you want to bulk you got to bulk clean you don't have to do dirty bulking anyways coming back to the point so in winters when you eat pretty much everything there is obviously you you tend to hold a lot of water uh, water means it could be fat it could be water weight so winters gives you an opportunity to cover it up obviously you know you don't the last thing you would want is to have a belly you know hanging out uh, uh, you know and if you're wearing a t-shirt so that's why you know when you're wearing pullovers cardigans jackets it kind of gets covered up so you know and plus it makes you look a little bigger so people ask you that question hey man have you been working out you look bigger you look you know a lot bigger and stronger so that's one of the reasons why people plus there's another reason why bulking may be of help to a lot of people is because you know obviously you're not sweating much you know uh, uh, and, and because you're not sweating it gives you an opportunity to eat more because what happens is if you see it in summers because we sweat so much you know our hunger usually compared to winters if you if you were to imagine if you were to go back to your days you would know that we tend to eat a lot in our winter season for a fact that obviously we're more hungry it's genetically we like that compared to in summers we're not too hungry because a the weather is too hot you know all you want to do is bloody drink drink water drink, drink smoothies and stuff like that so winter gives us that opportunity to eat more you eating more a two you're lazy three you know you can eat anything and get away with it by wearing jackets and pullovers so that's why people bulk in in winters but can you do bulking in summers yes you can do that so long you're comfortable flaunting your belly by wearing a t-shirt it's all entirely up to you coming back to summers and cutting now what happens in summers obviously you know uh, because you're sweating uh, uh, you know, you have to wear your t-shirts, you have to wear all kinds of skimpy clothes. You would want to look skinny, you want to look leaner and meaner. So chances of whatever you've gained, muscle mass that you've gained in winter in your bulking phase, time for you to kind of now get rid of that water weight and get leaner by showing off what you've gained. But what happens is, you know, people tend to go in a different direction altogether they eat pretty much everything they feel okay you know what because we've done bulking uh, uh, now you know in cutting we just have to you know cut down all our calories right from if you were eating 3000 calories now we have to eat 1500 calories it doesn't work like that guys because if you were to do that and i've discussed this in my videos you don't have to bring your calories down in summers just to kind of you know you know fit into those t-shirts because what has happened is or what you may tend to do is whatever gains you've made in bulking by eating and now you you know kind of you know minimizing your calories almost to a half you know you're compromising on your gain so what's the point of bulking in the first place so that's why guys in summers it's always a good idea for you to kind of first figure out you know because mostly you know, we Indians we tend to mistake 
our thirst with the hunger most of the times you know if you were to ask me and it has happened with me so many times that i've confused if i'm thirsty i often think that you know uh, uh, you know uh, uh, maybe uh, maybe you know need some food you know, call me whatever but you know it happens you know wherever you go to meet your friend to meet your relative the first thing they ask you what do you want to eat what do you want to eat even if we don't want to eat we are forced to be you know forced we are forcefully fed and that okay you must eat something but remember guys your body is a beautiful machinery it will tell you you know uh, if you are hungry or if you are thirsty remember every time you are hungry have a glass of water first thing have a glass of water it will tell you there was it was thirst which was making you hungry or you were genuinely hungry chances are 60 to 70% of the times we often mistake our hunger uh, after our hunger with our thir- with our, th- our thirst with our hunger so when we should be drinking some fluids technically water i don't mean aerated drinks we tend to eat and obviously it leads to calorie surplus it leads to you know those unwanted calorie build up and we end up gaining weight and then we complain that hey you know cutting doesn't work for me you know i can only bulk and stuff like that guys so coming back to bulking and cutting the idea for you is to make the most of the season you know in india we have typically 3 to 4 seasons you know which is you know include winter summer autumn everything we got to make use of it and you know winters gives us an opportunity to pack on more muscle and summer gives you an opportunity because you're sweating you tend to not eat much just drink more on fluids so that you get back in shape so this is just one of those reasons that you know i could figure out from my reading from asking people there is no science behind it guys so if somebody were to tell you that is back by science is bullshitting you so i hope this answers your question now it's summer is officially in delhi uh, and mumbai anyways you know a uh, uh, flaunch good weather you know a little humid weather so you can be in shape all through the year you have to stay lean all through the year so anyone of you who have any questions around cutting bulking uh, weather specific you know uh, you can obviously reach out to me on my facebook youtube or instagram and i'll be very happy to help you with your gain so until we meet again peace